Alright, hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome back to Disgaea Afternoon of Darkness PC, whatever you want to call it. I keep wanting to say Disgaea 5, and that's not the case. Anyway, so I did some looking up, and apparently, uh, for Disgaea 1, healers do not gain experience for healing. How persistent! Are all demons like this? I have no other choice. I'll have to use a sleep spell. Nighty night! Oh, no, you don't! Briar fire prep risk! Flames, burn that girl to the ground! Fairy barrier balladare! Mirror reflect the flames! Whoa! Ow! So, because I can't, uh, level up Potato at all, uh, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with her. Anyway, so we're seeing as we can't level her up conventionally. She needs some kind of attack move, or I just need to have her participate in as many team attacks as I can possibly manage. That's probably a good idea, actually. We'll do that for the time being, and eventually I'll figure something else better for her to do. I'll probably just reincarnate her or something as something else. Uh, let's see. Oh, hey. <laughs> I forgot. Laharl, uh, can learn heal from this. That's... useful? Actually, in that case... Let's move her here. We might as well start... lead in with a blade rush. Move Etna here. Grand Slam Man. Might as well boost up as many team attack folks as possible. Okay. Did not include the healer, though. Yeah, so chances are she's just gonna fall off the roster really fast. Unfortunately. Unless, if she's right next to Ledoot, does she get... Yeah. So they have to be... They have to... It has to be like an apprentice situation. Otherwise it won't work. So let's not bother with it. And of course, all of these guys still have just maxed out ice resistance. Which sucks. Well, that's just obnoxious. Okay. So we've got... We've got that. Yeah, that'll do. And I guess Yugurn is level 7. Let's bring in Grand Slam Man instead. We might as well kill one zombie this way. Okay. Yeah, so I'll probably reincarnate the Prinius as other characters. And I'm probably not going to bother with uh, Potato at all. Even. Because we're going to be getting Flan soon enough. I'll just make sure I teach Flan some spells. And then we'll go from there. Because I think that's the better solution than what I've currently got, which is struggle to get a healer to be at least mildly competent in combat, but mostly just be like, what do I do with this character? Which is ultimately what I'd end up doing, and I don't want to do that. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go for a bunch of damage dealers. I mean, hell, I could even get to the point where I don't even need healers. Uh, which is actually an attractive-ish prospect. Or, you know, eventually I'd just give, like, Laharl healing duties. Cause he'll have- Laharl or some other mage. I don't- I don't know. I don't know, man. Alright, uh, let's move you. Might as well keep leading in with these blade brushes. They're pretty good for just- going straight through people. Uh, let's see. It's probably a good chance for Ledoot. Actually, very small chance. Like, if I could get her to reincarnate as something else, that, that would also solve the problem. That was not enough for a level, though. <laughs> Okay, let's send Laharl out this direction. Well, luckily, she still gets better as a healer, but we'll just we'll just supplant her with Flaw and call it a day. Go from there. Unfortunately, I think uh, I think 
Oh, shoot. Ledute is going to fall off, at least for this zone. Because everybody here is ice resistant. Which is... Uh... I'd say I wasn't thinking, but ultimately I just didn't know. Oh man, Hell Pepper. That is kind of dumb, though. The whole, uh... Does not get experience. Okay, so we want to do Tiger Charge on this guy. Uh, does not get experience unless you manage to get a kill. I'm fairly certain... Well, that's... They definitely changed it somewhat for Disgaea 5. I don't think they changed it for Disgaea 2 either. Oh, she's out of SP. Well, that sucks. Uh... You probably can't do anything, but it's a good level experience. Uh, good spot to level up that skill. Okay. Uh, I don't think she's gonna... No, she does have enough SP. We might as well just pretty raid one of these guys. Uh, I'm just gonna wait until things happen. We might kill him, we might not. That was pretty lackluster. This is going to be pretty just disappointing. Well... I mean... I tried. Kinda. Okay, we can kill that guy at least. Definitely reincarnating the Prinnies, though. Probably not as monsters, either. Unfortunately, monster skills are kind of junky in this game. I In the Disgaea games in general, I actually really wish um, any monster could use any other monster skills. So there's a reason you'd want to have, like, monster characters. Uh, but that's just not a thing. Ow! This is going to be one costly mission. Because everybody is poisoned, and it sucks. Well, Harl, how much HP SP do you have? Plenty. Blazing Knuckle. So he should probably be able to solve all of these problems by himself. Okay, I'm gonna just bring... Ah, shit. Can't bring Ledoot back. He'll just die. Okay. Hopefully Laharl will be, a be enough to take him out the rest of the way. Please do damage. There we go. Okay, yeah, we got this. There's one dude left, and they will not be able to kill the Harl, but yeah, it's, Oh, God, the hospital bill is going to be very high. Well, at least he goes for the one guy that is, uh... was going to die of poison anyway. So she might be able to kill him? We might as well move everybody else in for an assist. I guess it probably doesn't matter that much. But yeah, if we can get the extra damage. I was hoping for Maharo, but guess not. Alright. Well, maybe... Hopefully, Grand Slam Man gets the final blow. At least he does damage. Unlike that other pretty. At least we got 600 health from that. So, uh, how much do we make? We make... Ooh, that hurt. That hurt bad. That was a lot of money lost. Okay. Yeah, playing this really does make me miss uh, Disgaea 5. But, like, you can say they didn't... Oh, whatever. You can't escape. I'm proud to say that I am the most persistent demon in all the netherworld. That's so. Wow. That's really something. Are you trying to make a fool of me? No, I think that's the way she is. <laughs> now it's my turn to show off a little. But I'll have to use the item the Seraph gave me, so I can only do it once. Are you ready? Here I go! Prince, I think we're playing by her rules. Dorian Dragon Dranago! Dragon, come forth! Prince, we
we have to fight this? We don't have much choice, do we? One thing I wish the Disgaea games would do is uh, give up on the concept of um, singular tile characters. Like, I'd love to see this dragon like two to three times its size for like active, awesome scale, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so this is going to suck. Like, real hard. So here's what we're going to do. You know, that did not work out as well as I hoped it would. Honestly, we might be in trouble here. How much HP? Nine. Probably can't do it with a Ladoot. I might actually have to do some grinding. Please tell me I saved between missions. I don't think I did. Damn. That's the one thing I don't like about the Disgaea games. There's a very real possibility that uh, you can lose and lose progress and shit, they're all coming. Well, say goodbye to most swords. Yeah, she's done. And he's poisoned. Okay. I mean, we might still be able to do something. Losing more mo swords like that is going to hurt. And of course, all of my other characters are just prinnies, which does not help anybody's case. Uh, let's see. I guess I might as well try and stack some team attacks here without getting in uh, Laharl's way. But yeah, I'm probably going to have to go back and do some grinding, which I do not appreciate. I don't know. Like, I don't mind grinding in games, but it can feel, like, really tedious at times, uh, just because... Like, I would like to make progress on things, and fuck, yeah, we're doomed. I would like to make progress on things and not have to just go back and redo the same level over and over and over again. Like, I don't mind once my characters are past a certain point, but... Gonna be honest, the Disgaea games have just kind of the worst difficulty scaling ever. Alright, let's just attack this guy. Are you... God damn it. Alright, whatever. I think Laharl's included. So we have a chance of killing it. There we go. This is... We're done. Because he's going to be poisoned and fucking hell pepper, man. Okay. Let's keep doing Skull Splitter. He's got too much HP. Okay, Tiger Charge. I could do Blazing Knuckle, but it's probably not going to do anything for me. Uh, so we'll just go in for a Tiger Charge. If I can maybe get the Dragon down, though, to help. Though, honestly, I really need to take out these Hell Pepper dudes. They're almost as dangerous. Fuck. I'm not going to be able to kill that Dragon. Hey, I haven't saved at all this episode, have I? I mean, it's only, like, 15 minutes. Okay, that did something. I'm gonna see if I can damage these a little bit more than I have been. Okay. And unfortunately, I don't think we get reincarnation until after this mission, which sucks, because that's what we need. Maybe? Maybe not. I mean, really, I'd just like to replace my prinnies with non prinnies I guess I could try and use a healing move if... Uh, not a healing move, a healing item if Laharl lives through this.
Okay. We're not dead yet. Okay, Edna's still alive. We still got her. Okay. So please tell me you have enough SP for another... God damn it. For another one of those. The answer is no. That is obnoxious. So I'm gonna ignore Flan. Flan is meaningless. Dragon's an issue. She's poisoned. So I've got some gum I can eat. I'm just gonna move him over here. Okay, so he managed to get killed. If it's just the dragon, we might have a chance here. Okay, and lastly, we're gonna bring out Ledoot as a distraction. We've got Laharl, who is poisoned. We got Ledoot, and... Actually, Flan probably doesn't have ice resistance here. What about the dragon? Damn it! Okay, uh, do you have any SP? Not enough. So we're gonna start with the Prinny. Attack Magenta, then we're gonna try and do... Tiger Charge. It probably does more damage than Blazing Knuckle. We might be able to do this, damn it. That barely does anything. Tiger Charge, on the other hand, might actually do some amount. We might have this. Okay. And regardless of whether or not he dies here, we're just going to use that. Yeah, if I can take out the dragon, Flan folds. The poison is a concern, but sh fuck, she can heal. There goes, there he goes. Yeah, if we hadn't lost Mo's sword so early on in this fight, we might have had a chance there. Okay. That was a little bit more damage. That was a little bit more too. Hopefully he doesn't go for Laharl or Laharl lives through it. Okay. Well, there goes Flan. No more healing. Yeah! Alright. Uh, skin of my teeth, but I think we win. Okay, let's cancel that. Let's lead in with, uh, let's lead in with the Prinny. Okay. It's not much, but it guarantees the Tiger Charge kills him off. Oh man, that was tight. You've caused a lot of trouble for me. I don't know who hired you, but I'll make you regret the day you tried to assassinate the Great Laharl. Uh, excuse me, but why would I want to assassinate you? Huh? I am Angel Trainee Flan. I am here by order of the Seraph to assassinate the Overlord, King Krichevskoy. You're here to kill my old man? Your old man? That means you're the king's son? Doesn't anyone in Celestia read the newspaper? You came all the way from Celestia for nothing. My old man died two years ago. <sighs> I'm sorry. H hey, why are you crying? Your father passed away, right? You'll never see him again. When I think about that, it makes me sad. Huh? Are you crazy? You came here to assassinate him, right? Why should you be sad? Are you not sad? Me? I don't have that emotion. That's not true. When you lose someone or something important to you, you cry, don't you? Your heart aches, doesn't it? Hmm. I don't understand a word you're saying. How come? How come? Because
because I'm a demon, of course. Demons don't know sadness? E exactly! I've never experienced such an emotion in my entire life! If that's true, then does that mean demons don't know love either? Sadness is only possible because of love! You're right! Demons have no love either! That's... that's just... too sad! She sounds just like my mother. How stupid. Love. What good is it? What's the point in having it? Love's the reason mother is dead! I don't believe. I'll never believe in love! If demons really don't know love, then it's my duty as a Celestian to explore the matter. I was ordered to assassinate the Overlord. This must be a sign from the heavens. It has to be. Whether demons are pure evil or not, if they really don't feel love, I will bear witness to the truth. What's love good for? I don't need it. Demons like me don't need that kind of crap. If that is true, then demons are a real threat to Celestia. Since I can't complete my mission, I have decided that my new goal is to learn the true nature of demons. I must know for certain whether or not demons are capable of love. And if necessary, I will carry out my original mission with a new target. <laughs> Right? Be my guest! I shall burn a true vision of horror into that empty head of yours! Angel Trainee Flan joined your party. <sighs> Prince, what are you doing recruiting an assassin? And an angel at that? But this might avert his attention from me. <laughs> Perfect timing. Episode 2, Enter Flan, End. At long last, the nefarious Angel Flan seems to have forsaken her evil ways. N nefarious Angel? But... Can an old dog learn new tricks? Flan suddenly reverts to killing machine, slaughtering a crowd of innocent demons! C killing machine? Finally, she transforms into a space monster! Could this be the end of the netherworld? Space monster? All right, it's time for me to transform! Next on Space Detective Etna, Episode 3. Etna versus Space Monster Flan. I'll protect the Netherworld at any cost! I want to be a space detective, too! Too bad. Save. Yes! Oh, God, yes! Salary? Yep. Today is the Pretty Squad's payday. I get that part. Now, explain to me why I have to pay your vassal's salary. My vassals are your vassals, right? Well, then it's only natural that you sign their paychecks. Ugh, I can't argue with that. Fine, but it's not coming out of my pocket. Huh? I thought you had plenty of money. That's my allowance. No one's touching it. Stingy. Shut up! So who's the richest guy around here? We'll just loot his place. Is he always like this? Yep, always. I've never met anybody like that in Celestia. I'd be amazed if you did. But you won't last long in the netherworld if something like this surprises you. Oh, this is such a culture shock to me. Episode 3, A Hint of Kindness.
Well, we managed to make it through that last mission by the skin of our teeth. We have flan now. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save again. Uh, does Flan come with equipment? She comes at level 5, she's got a Witch's Staff, which is okay, and a Fancy Lid, which is also okay. Okay, so first things first, we need to do a couple of things. Oh, I see. Who will address the assembly? Uh, so I'm actually gonna get rid of two characters. Uh, I know it's a bit bit of a waste, but I'm actually going to get rid of Ledoot and Potato, uh, because they're both, um, spellcaster characters, and they, I'd, I'd be much better off if I deleted them and apprenticed them to Flan instead, uh, because there's no way to ch shift them around. Nope, no dice. Might be able to do a promotion exam. Hey, let's try, let's do a promotion exam. I'll do the other stuff later. I actually don't even know what promotion exams do. Uh, I've it's been so long, and I've I've actually forgotten what what happens during them. Uh, what the point is, what the like general effect is. I just remember like kind of acing them a bunch with Laharl with Blazing Knuckle, and that was kind of the extent of it. But I don't remember what the lasting benefits are. I think it's supposed to like rank up their class. I actually don't know. Oh! No, is this how I unlock new things? In the, uh... In the... Netherworld Assembly. Yeah! Okay, so now we can do raise military funds, which will never work. More expensive stuff. And that's it. So yeah, by doing promotions and exams, you get other... Other things that you can do along the way. I think. Let me guess. Flan has zero mana to start with, though. That sucks. All right. Well, I guess with that, I'm gonna I'm gonna sign off for now. I'll get do some grinding. I'll get everybody up in levels so we don't just run into, <laughs> uh, we don't just get our ass kicked because I've been lazy. And um, I'll make sure Flan has at least some offensive moves. Otherwise, she's going to be a complete garbage character for the entirety of the series, because currently all she has is a healing spell, and that's not acceptable. So, I guess with that, I'll see you guys next time, and as always, thanks for watching.